Hi there, it's Darren. You've been asked to record something on your phone, which either sounds really fun or it sounds like it's worse than going to the dentist four days in a row with no drugs. In any case, I'm gonna give you some tips on this video that will set you up for success. Um, some absolutes at the start, and then as we go on, some things that will help this all be more flattering and maybe a little bit easier. So here we go. Number one thing, if you do nothing else, if you do nothing else, Make sure when you shoot this, you hold your phone horizontally. That means like this, not like this, like this. This, vertical, that's why it has those funny bars on either side. We don't want that. We want your face to fill the entire screen. Number two is lighting. This is a really easy thing to do. You're simply looking for great daylight and a window in your house. See, see if you put the window in front of you, it fills your face really nicely. Let me show you this in back of you. This is called back lighting. See how it gets all flared out and distracting and you can't see your face? No good. So simply turn it around. Close your face. Go up in. If you're doing a lot of Zoom calls, a lot of things on camera, you might want to invest in one of these table lights. You can get them now for like 20, 25 bucks on Amazon or other places, but really you don't need it. You just need that good window light pouring in and filling in Places. It's really the best thing that you can do. So, halo light maybe, but really all you need is the window in front of your face and come back. Number three, how are you gonna frame yourself up? Now I know people don't wanna get too close, but you really don't wanna be this far away and you don't wanna be that close. Really, if you kinda of think about top of your shoulders up, nice, comfortable distance, you really can't go wrong with that. Shoulders up. What are you going to wear? All right, this one's pretty simple. You want a solid color, and if you can have a bright color, that's even better. See, like a bright color against white background works really well. See, if I wear white against white background, it's kind of washed out, it's kind of popped out, you don't want that. And if I wear a top with a busy pattern, like this one, I happen to really love this blouse, but you're looking at the flowers and all the things, that's where the eye is going, instead of listening to what I have to say. So let's go back to the solid color. And finally, flattering. Let's do flattering. Where does your phone go? Okay, this is where you don't want it to go. You go down here, whoo, I don't even want you to see down there. But if you just hold it up just a little bit higher than your eyes and look down, that is gonna be your most flattering angle. So we have the horizontal thing down. You know how you're gonna hold your phone. The next thing you wanna figure out is where is the camera on your phone? You're looking for that little dot either be on that side or that side. That's where you're gonna wanna look. You wanna look right into that. You don't wanna look over here, you don't wanna look up here. You wanna look into that little dot. And here's another little clue of what you can do. If you're self-conscious about being on camera, it's because you're thinking about who's looking at you. But here's a little hack, a little trick. Think about who you're looking at. Think of somebody you really like, a really good friend, somebody you love, and picture them through that hole. You are talking to them, so you're looking at them, not that the world's looking at you. It'll help you get rid of a lot of those little kind of jittery feelings. Look at the person that you like through that little pinpoint. So you're all set to go. You know to hold your phone horizontal. You know you're gonna hold it a little bit up. You know where your camera is. You know that your light's gonna go in front of your face and you know you're gonna look right through that little hole towards somebody you really like or really love, and you are going to rock this.